spiders. Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video. Uh, let me briefly explain to you how the process worked for the last four videos. Uh, what happened was yesterday morning I sat down and played about an hour and a half worth of Minecraft and um, then I spent uh, about two hours after that, two or three hours, editing the videos and then I set the videos to process on my computer, uh, well to render on my computer and I um, it ju that just took forever. I got up and did a bunch of other things. I went to friends' houses and stuff like that. So anyway, uh, point is, it took a long time to get them all um, processed, and then after that, well, no, before I started processing them, I set up a VNC client on my computer so that I could log in from friends' computers and upload the videos. That's how you were able to get updates all day and for some part of today uh, on the videos from yesterday morning. So <laughs> whenever I get comments from you guys saying like, uh, make a sunroof, which is what I'm going to do in this video. I'm going to make a sunroof because you guys really really want a sunroof but um yeah whenever i get comments like that and you see like in the next three videos like if you made it on the first video and like in the next three videos i'm not doing anything with it or it seems like i'm not responsive to any like good ideas that are coming through then um it's it's because i played that like an hour and a half well before i got any of the comments and that's what's going to happen with this next series of videos as well uh i'm going to make uh this music gets me every time <laughs> this music makes me want to this music makes me want to shut up so i don't talk over it because it's so gorgeous but anyway, yeah, I'm going to make a sunroof, um, and if I don't seem to be paying attention to the comments or like taking the feedback and using it in the next video, it's because uh, the videos that come out in the series are videos that I've spent, uh, are footage that I've spent well before I got uh, any of your comments. So anyway, one of the good suggestions was to take this door. Well, yeah, that's my grass. One of the good suggestions, wait, I think there's a spider on my house. I heard it squeaking. There we go. One of the good suggestions was to take the door, which is very durable. There we go. And put it on the outside of the house. Which I'll do. And the spider's gonna come and get me. I know he is. Ah, dang it. Ah, the sword isn't in the right spot. Die! Dang it. Oh, dang it! Not cool. Not cool. <laughs> I should have done that during the day. I gotta run back to my... Run back to the X cave at night again with no inventory and hope nothing catches me off guard there's a creeper right there he's coming for me a bunch of cows protect me cows wow the creepers no he stopped chasing me he figured I wasn't worth it he figured I wasn't worth ending his own life <laughs> anyway here's all my stuff that dang spider again. And I don't have my door up. Ah! Get away from me, spider! Don't kill me again, please! Oh, God. I hate you. Alright, I'm gonna own that spider's face. And now I hear a zombie. Where is that spider? I just. This axe ought to suffice. There's my sword. Move, cow. Maybe the cows killed it. I hope they killed it. Alright, the creepers also spawn at night. Alright, so that was a dumb idea. But I'm gonna do it again anyway. It was suggested that I put this on the outside of my house, which is exactly what I'm gonna do. Stay in there, chicken, or get away, whatever. There we go. Now the door's on the outside. And skeletons can't shoot in. Alright, so that was the first suggestion you guys made, so thank you very much for that. That's a good idea. Second one was to make a sunroof. That's gonna have to wait until morning. Um, a third one was to make another window out here, like right here, so that I don't have to keep running up to the front, to the fort, to. Uh... Oh man, my inventory is all jacked up. Let me fix that real quick. So that I don't have to keep running over to the front to see what time of day it is. And that's not a bad idea. Wait, I should use an axe for that because that pick's gonna take forever. There we go. There we go. And I think this is where spiders spawn, so great care must be taken for this. Alright, now I don't have to keep going up to the front to see what time of day it is, which is good. And I'm actually going to make this a much, uh, a much more clean area of the X-Cave later on. But right now, one of the things that I want to do most is explore this, which I just opened up. 
So, yeah, I'd love to explore all of this stuff. But I don't want to go down there without the proper equipment. I know that I'm going to need food, and I want to make armor as well. And for that, I'm going to need cowhide. Or steel. I'm going to construct my first steel items uh, in just a bit, as soon as it becomes daytime. And I don't see anything extremely threatening. Oh, someone else also mentioned in the comments that I had uh, arrows in here. And I think you're right, unless I already... Yeah, I think I already took them out. So I'm out of arrows, is that it? Yeah, I'm out of arrows. And um, I can make more if I get flint. And for flint, I need gravel. But I don't see any actual gravel. Let me know if you guys saw gravel as I was building in any of the previous videos, or if you see it as I'm running around and I miss it. Because gravel sometimes drops flint, and the flint is what I need to make arrows. And arrows is what I need to safely explore any given area. Wow, I don't know what that goes to. Wow, I just left the door open. That's retarded. But, uh, yeah, actually, I'm going to do the same thing here that I did with the front door. There we go. I'm going to place the door on this side of it. There we go. That way a skeleton isn't very like... Well, I guess a skeleton could still stand right here and shoot through if he wanted to, but it makes it a little more difficult for him to do so. And I hear stuff going on in here. That's not very wise for me to get to. Actually, I think I was safe from what I saw last time um, from in this little spot. So, I believe the best idea for me right now, since it's nighttime... There we go, nice little steps up, is to mine this out. Can't get enough iron. If I was really bold, I would go and... I only have two torches left. This isn't the best way to be knocking a hole through the wall, though, I don't think. Why, you ask? Because this direction will lead back out. That's the east. That I think that's the east. That will lead back out into the uh, field. Meaning this way delves deeper into the mountain. Oh, I hear water. Do you guys hear that? Okay, so this was not as much of a threat as I thought it was when I first fell down here. It was still incredibly scary. This is now officially a part of the X-Cave. Ooh, and I see more iron up there. That's okay. Like I said, I don't really want to explore too deep in there without any torches or any other supplies. I need to make preparations before I go there. I mean, while it's still nighttime, let's get cooking. Let's put some coal underneath the furnace and start cooking that. And actually I might do well to make a whole other furnace. Let's make a second one. And we will put some coal in there too. Some coal in that furnace, and another slab of meat. This one should be finished. Yes, it is. Put some more meat there. And let's get some meat out of the chest here, because I'm going to cook up all of this, because I'm about to take it down into the depths of the X cave. This meat should be done. Get this one going. This one should be done. Get this one going. Let's add some more coal. There we go. This one's finished. That one started. Let's see what else I have here that would be of use to me. I'll put the feathers in there because I don't need them yet. I don't need the string. Here's all my coal. Alright, and what I'm going to do now is make some more steel. 
Uh, I'm going to take half of it, and put it in this furnace, take this food back, and I'm going to put just a little bit more coal in there, and take the other half of the iron and have it smelt steel for me. So I'll have both furnaces working. Alright then. And using this, I need some wooden sticks. I think I have wooden sticks already in the box here. No, I do not. It's daytime now. I'm going to head on top of the... Well, I guess I can just work on it from in here. Let's see, where should this sunroof start? It should be f a fair size, so it lets plenty of light in. I'll start it right here. Let's see, that's one tile away from... I'll make it two tiles away from the back of the wall. And I'll have it progress to two tiles over there, and then we'll make a big rectangle out of it. Okay, so one... There's one, two tiles, there we go. And it will go to over here. It's one tile, two tiles. Here's the other corner of it. That's, uh, let's see. One tile, two tiles. No, we'll start right here. That's good. All right. And then we'll match on this side. Wow, that's plenty of light coming in now. All right, so let's open that up. Reclaim some of these planks, at least. That's not bad. Well, there goes the first X. Wow, I kind of like this. I wasn't going to build a sunroof because, I don't know, they just don't... I like the idea of being, like, hidden and, like, nobody being able to see in but me being able to see out, like, you know, from small holes like windows and things like that. But, um... Oh, wow, I need plenty of glass. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> Better make a ton of glass before... Uh, night hits. And I've got a lot of sand, so making glass is not going to be a problem. Let's go check on our steel. Eight here. Eight here. Alright. That's going to come in handy. But first, we still got plenty of coal in there. Let's take half of the sand and put it in here. Take the other half of the sand and put it in here. Alright, so that's going to make glass for me. And while that makes glass, so that I can finish up the sunroof, I'm going to go collect more food. Someone also asked in the comments um, how come they weren't getting food when they killed pigs. It may be because you're not using a weapon. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I don't get meat every time I kill a pig. Um, and I don't think I can get meat whenever I use my fists or, or pick or something like that. So it probably has to be a weapon, like a sword or a bow. But what I really want are these cows right now. Because they have this hide, and I'm going to use this hide to make armor. Come here, cow. There you go. That was a big one. He dropped two. I mean, she. Since it's a cow, it's definitely a she. Wow, look at all this that we still haven't seen. This is raw, untapped potential out here. I wonder how far I can travel. It's almost high noon. So we still got enough time in the day, and my furnaces are still cooking glass back at the X cave. Well, they're not cooking glass, technically. What's that over there? I don't see any cows left. Although that's what I came out here for. This has become an exploration mission, I guess. There's a chicken. There's some cows. Come here, chicken. I need feathers, too. Perfect. Is this bamboo? What is this? or barley? Well, that's not wheat. It's clearly not wheat. I don't know what that is. It's grass of some kind. But it, I'm sure it'll come in handy. Hello, cow. Oh, my sword's not in good...